Today's workout um, was pretty tough, you know, it's week nine and I think all of the factors that come into a, a weight cut is actually taking a toll on me and it's combining and it's really bringing me down now. So one, I'm on a caloric deficit, been on a caloric deficit for eight weeks so I can feel the toll of that. Two, work has been really crazy and that's not something you can ignore. Like if you have a lot of stressors at work, that can also take a toll on your body. Uh, three, today uh, I don't have my normal team members with me. And so today is just relying on myself and I kind of had to go through the workout all by myself, which is nothing wrong with it because training is for yourself. But I usually when I'm down, I can depend on my team to help bring me back up today. I had to do all that by myself. And four, I don't usually drink any caffeine like monsters or pre-workout. I just drink like a very simple natural coffee or green tea. And today I felt like I had to drink the whole can of monster just to feel normal. So it's one of those, uh, it's one of those workouts where you get in and everything, every single cell in your body is telling you, go home, you're tired, go take a nap, go eat something, you know? But I think that's why it's so cool to have a goal. Because when you have a goal in mind, that's that one beacon, that light at the end of the tunnel that's like, nah, you gotta keep going forward, you gotta keep going forward. If you wanna graduate college, it doesn't matter how many hot chicks are taking their clothes off for you, well, that might matter. But it doesn't matter how many parties are there, it doesn't matter what's going on you have that goal and you're striving for it. And I have that goal. So I still got the work done, um, but it was really, really hard. It's just one of those days where it's just, it's not an amazing workout, but I got it done and I'm still proud of myself for doing it. What I'm gonna try to do in the next couple of weeks is try to schedule my days out a little bit tighter during the day, just so I have more rest at night, hopefully sleep nine, 10 hours. And I might finally give myself a refeed, like a legit two or three day refeed. And that might shoot my weight up a little bit for the short term, but I think ultimately it'll revitalize my body and it'll reset my mind and I'll be able to hit a little bit harder. And also um, I might just take a, a maybe like a semi deload maybe for two or three days, just so I don't keep taxing my body. Like if I'm at on the verge of dying, like mentally and physically dying, I think taking a temporary break is going to be good for the long-term success of what I'm trying to do. So hopefully I do that and I hit the last couple of weeks really, really hard and finish out really strong.